very important remedy, X-ray. X-ray actually has been proved many years back. Finke, Finke has proved about this remedy, as you know. It's one of the most important remedies for infertility and low sexual uh, desire. In fact, it is one of the most important lack of reaction remedies. And then all remedies kind of uh, are prescribed in many complicated cases, not just of hormonal disorders, even skin disorders, very bad cases of psoriasis, skin eczema, when all remedies fail. And just there is a dryness of the skin. X-ray is a top remedy. Even in cases of cervical spondylosis, we are using X-ray. Even in cases of women's uh, PCOD, um, endometriosis, and all remedies fail, we are using X. X-ray is a, like a, a little bit like a, it, it opens up the block. It's, it is, you can't call it as an anti-miasmatic, um, although actually in today's times you can use, but you can see it's a very important intercurrent. One of our colleagues asked that why uh, gynecomastia is so common. I do believe it has to do with our lifestyle and it has to do with the diet and it also has to do with um, the way we are living our life and, and also with the food which is pumped with so many hormones. And you know that, for example, meat, soya bean, so many are, are having additions of hormones. Our, the, our food is not as pure as it was 30 years back. The meat size is increasing. The egg size is increasing. They are being pumped with, pumped with too many hormones. Too much of estrogen, too much of prolactin, too much of hormones in them. That could be one of the main reasons. And bad lifestyle. Let's come back to X-ray. X-ray is, is one of the most important remedies that we are using. In fact, just day before yesterday, we used it in... Um, not day before yesterday, maybe some days back. We are even using it in many cases of leukemia with very low vitality and in many cases of hematopoietic disorders. Especially it is useful for conditions where there is no presenting symptoms and when well-selected remedies fail. Total sexual desire is lost. And here dilutions are made from absolute alcohol uh, which are irritated with x-rays through glass bottles. X-ray have a property of stimulating cellular metabolism. Very often these patients first complain of chronic fatigue. So many cases of chronic fatigue, unexplained weakness, low vitality, hematopoietic system getting affected. Very often this will come up as a very important remedy. In x-ray patients, this is also a very important clinical keynote. Many patients who have a lot of neck because of, you know, working on the computer like we work constantly. Patients who have neck stiffness, cervical spondylosis, cricks, a very important remedy is x-ray. The other remedy which we use, I told you, when there is more muscular spasm, think about semisifoga. But when there is more bone-related, um, uh, like a little uh, degeneration and cervical spondylosis and cricks, there is a noise that comes Think about remedies like X-ray. But I'm also trying to give you a little idea about the deeper inner pattern of X-ray. <clears throat> Especially I want to talk to you about uh, the mind state of X-ray. I think this is something that we normally don't study about. One of the very important rubrics of X-ray is delusion life is a burden. They perceive life in a very different way is X-ray. Um, and you can imagine X-ray is a, also a very important remedy for post-radiation. For post-radiation, in, in even in oncological cases, you know, post-radiation, post-radiation oncological cases. In oncological cases or even generally, there are some remedies that we use more often. One of them is definitely X-ray, which we normally don't think about. The other remedies are radium bromide. Cobalt, nitricum, cadmium salts, radon, and some more remedies. Okay? In some cases also, iodine salts. One of them is natrium iodine. In all of these cases, generally we start with 30 and 200. And you won't believe all these remedies have an action on the generative sphere. They have an action on hormones and typically 
all of them have action on ovaries and testes. In fact, most of them are very important remedies for infertility. Interesting, no? I'm trying to give you a very broader perspective. Huh? My idea is not to tell you this remedy, this diagnosis. My idea is, you know, I want to share with you in such a way that you start thinking. You start having your own way of thinking. That The biggest, for me, the biggest special moment for me is when I see my colleagues, people who are working with me, who are learning with me, or I'm learning with them. I see them also having their own thought process. Their own individual thinking. Not this remedy is this diagnosis. Just, just the fact that they are thinking, they are thinking, trying to put their mind into it is what really is something that is exciting for me. So why, why, one of the reasons why I ask you what remedies you're thinking, because I'm constantly thinking, you know, how, what is the thought process that you're having? How we can work on it more? And that's what I try to do, actually. It is only by really, really uh, discussing ideas, thoughts, analysis that we can grow. And that's what I highly recommend uh, to all our colleagues, to analyze, to discuss, put our minds on all these things. And for rest of the things, you know, it's not worth it. Okay, let's come back. Let's come back to the remedy X-ray and inner patterns of X-ray. <clears throat> so many of you have been asking, and we discussed about this, which could be our next possible kind of course. And 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 all of you have been studying with us for the last so many years. But But something very interesting that we are doing for the first time as we are planning to start the first one of its kind dermatological kind of masterclass for close to I would say 25 to 30 hours. So this is what we are trying to arrange for you. Something that you might have not this kind of world class course which is homeopathic strategies in dermatological disorders the tagline is become a homeopathic skin specialist because even even you know the skin disorders have so much of deeper psychosomatic affection that even many skin doctors in allopathy they refer their cases to homeopaths that you know in fact many skin specialists also prescribe homeopathy as you know typically they give thuja for example but much more than that, let's let's go to the depth. And who are our absolute top of the top teachers of, of this course? We have we have probably the finest clinicians that we have in India, and we are especially invited people from different schools together. We have Dr. Shubhas Singh, who's 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 a master of keynotes from West Bengal. He will be talking about keynotes in skin disorders. We have Dr. Ashok Borkar. Of course, his, his approach in pathological cases. Dr. Gajanan Dhanipkar. Dr. Mayuresh Mahajan talking about psychodynamics and homeopathy. For the first time with us, Dr. Parinaz Umranwala, a gem of a homeopath, a very senior clinician. Uh, Dr. Jaswan Patil, an allopathic doctor who, who's a great uh, clinician. We have Dr. Praveen Jain who's going to talk about uh, especially his approach in children's cases and skin disorders. Dr. Rasal also. We also have our colleague from Croatia, Dr. Anna, who's going to talk about backflower remedies and homeopathy. So it's going to be a one-of-a-kind kind of a course. We are going to talk about different topics. We are going to talk about more than 50 remedies here. Cases of psoriasis, eczema, urticaria, vitiligo, herpes, ringworm, impetigo, lichen planus, molluscum, burns, bed sores, autoimmune disease. So it's it's going to be one of its kind. It's going to be in weekends. It's going to start in November end and uh, successfully treated cases with classical homeopathy, contemporary approach, repertorial techniques, keynotes technique, kingdom miasmatic techniques, miasmatic techniques. And you can study according to you. You will be given a certificate. It will be a one-year access. And... Um, only for our current course participants, there will be a massive discount. So it's something that we we have been preparing for a fairly long amount of time. It's something that I want to invite all of you. And I'm not, we are not going to announce this outside because 
uh, first we want our participants to join this and and participants who have been joining who have been part of our course for for so many years and who are part of this course get a special discount a discount that no one else gets other than all of you so 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 i want you guys to support us i want you guys to to be a part of this course because this is something we do for you this is something that we we work for you this is something that we develop for you and and it's something that helps our overall homeopathic community to grow to evolve and there are many more clinicians and of course i will also be uh, sharing some of our experiences so so i'm going to invite every single one of you to be a part of this um, <clears throat> you have to email me to get a direct um, early discount access to this course i want every single one of you that every single one of you who's watching me live now to be a part of us and um, get the earliest discount so the early you join you can get a early discount the first the first 100 150 people get a direct early access and an early discount so write to me within the next 10 minutes so we are very excited about this it starts in november end so you will have a nice diwali you will have a lot of gap a two month gap for you to watch it again and again and then starts the master class because this is very important this development of understanding the skin disorders how to go in depth how to look at clinical prescriptions how to go at a deeper level and it's <laughs>